Our solar system is really big, so it's not surprising there are some hypothetical celestial bodies to explain phenomena we observe in space. One hypothetical planet is Planet 9, also known as Planet X, and it's a debate if the planet even exists suddenly. But what is Planet 9? Let's find out. Planet 9 is theorized to be a gas giant, about 5 to 10 times the mass of Earth and 2 to 4 times the radius of Earth, and is thought to orbit much farther from Neptune, like 20 times farther from the Sun. That's very far. Let me do the calculation. That would take Planet 9 10,000 to 20,000 Earth years to orbit the Sun? That's lonely. You only think that way because your orbit takes only 88 Earth days. In the grand scheme of things, it's not even that long. Well, I guess if you think about it. I heard that following Neptune's discovery in 1846, the idea of another planet beyond Neptune started after astronomers noticed odd orbits of trans-Neptunian objects. The celestial body's orbits were so elliptical that people speculated another planet was influencing it. That's right! It's also similar to how Neptune was discovered because there were so many irregularities in Uranus's orbit that only the existence of another planet could explain it. Oh yeah, and in 1906, an astronomer named Hepperville Lowell tried to search for this hypothetical Planet 9, or Planet X as Gabriel Dahlin called it. Honestly, Planet X sounds so much better than Planet 9. Planet 9 sounds so much better! I'm calling it Planet X now just to spite you. Whatever. People also believe Planet 9 was formed around the same time as the other gas giants, but got flung out of the solar system due to gravitational interactions within the other gas giants. Also, did you know that Pluto was discovered because an astronomer named Clyde Tombaugh continued Lowell's search? Really? That's how that little guy came to be. You're small too, you know that. Anyways, astronomers thought Pluto was the planet X they had been searching for, but the predictions of what Planet X should look like and how Pluto looked like made astronomers so disappointed that they continued searching. It's Planet 9, you idiot! Technically, yes, in my heart, no. Whatever. Evidence for Planet 9? It's Planet X! I met Planet 9? Shut up! Anyway, people think Planet 9 exists because it explains the unusual orbit of celestial bodies like Sedna. And also, why distant celestial bodies are grouped together and move elliptically around the sun, or are tilted. Planet Nine? I haven't heard that name in a while. Do you know more about him? Yeah, we used to go way back. You know Planet X is a theoretical planet, right? How do you guys go way back? Yeah, I was lying, but I do know stuff about him. Because he is so far away from the sun, he would reflect barely any light, so that's why we haven't found him yet, if he exists. People in some of our planets are still looking for him. What planets? Me and my moons. Do you mean those tiny asteroids in your orbit? Hey, be nice. They can hear you. This is why I'm glad I have no moons. Loser, that's why you're forever lonely.